Hello, in today's video, I'm going to show you the effectiveness and the additional usage of the motion blades for the Ryobi uh, 54 inch 80 volt zero turn riding remora. I will also show you using other battery operated power equipment. This is how the backyard is looking. Leaves all over the place. I'm gonna try to use my lawnmower and my power equipment, battery operated, to take care of this. So I'll show you what happens here in a minute. These are the number of leaves in the front yard. Side, there's the front. As you can see, there's a lot of leaves out here. So I'm gonna try to do it with my battery operated equipment. And I'll show you the result. I'll show you a little bit of me operating the equipment and the end result. I'm gonna start out with my battery operated Ryobi backpack blower. It's a pretty big blower. The thing blows really well. And I have two batteries available. It's gonna use my five amp hour and four amp hour battery on this to blow the most of the leaves away from the house. And then I use my lawnmower for the others. Then I'll come back to this to blow the leaves off into the woods. First I blew the leaves away from the shed and the house. Now I go get my mower to mulch the rest of this. I'll be showing you different images from our security cameras. Show me carrying the equipment and using it as well. The backpack blower is a little bit bulky but it, uh, it's not as loud as it would seem and it has a very large fan on it. Okay, here we are on our way on the moor. And it's just nice and quiet. Got the police, so he set up the high. You can see what I have. I'm not gonna worry about that outside. I blow most of the leaves off that. Go ahead and go across the yard. Activating the blades.
spots right there that didn't seem to get up. We'll see what happens when I come back across. So far it's done an okay job, not a perfect job, but it's getting up most of the leaves. I think when I, if I do a cross cut, it should take care of the rest of those remaining small leaves. But uh, I'll show you that when I get to that point. Okay, I made a startling discovery. The reason why it wasn't motion that well is I had the blade set all the way high. If you look at my last path there, you see that I actually, <laughs> it cut up all the leaves. Uh, let me try this again. Now, let, let's try this. Watch this. Oh, now it's doing wonderfully. I had no idea that this was... The blades were set too high. I was not happy with the uh, original cut. But that's what happened. So as you can see, the motion is much better now. Yeah, looks much better. <laughs> so it wasn't the lawnmower's fault, it was my fault. Now you can see the difference. The last path there and one over there, perfectly mulched. The center of the spot is where I've gone over before, but that means that I had the blade set up too high. So this thing does a lot better than I thought it would do. My bad, waste of time, but let's go on with it. I finally got the front finished and as you can see there's no more new cut um, lines from the caster wheels not being in place. Here's the front. I'm not worried about perfection right now because all the leaves hadn't fallen but it made a big difference in how this thing looks. Once I lowered the blade I was happy with the results. Now on to the side yard, just want to see how it does. I'm not going to go all the way to the edge like I normally do. So now you can see the path I cut.
Now you can see the difference both to the lawn made. Now I'm gonna go get my power equipment and just blow the rest of the leaves off into the green space. Here I am putting finishing touches on this using my backpack blower. The blower is pretty industrious and it pushes everything back as far as I need. I really like my equipment. I think the backyard looks nice. The end result is the backyard. A few issues here and there, leaves blowing back, and might not be able to get the mower over there. But look at the edge. Quite a bit of difference from the large influx of leaves earlier. So I'll probably have to do this one more time this season. After all this, and pretty much cutting the front yard twice, I ended up with 39% battery left. That's pretty good, I think. Uh, normally when I cut the grass, all the grass, I wound up with 58%. But since I had to duplicate some effort, I think this is pretty good. Thanks for watching.